19 views, 64, 19, 33, 23, 16, 67, 12, 35, 33, 14, 15, 27, 17, 26, 24, 22, 83, 134. Oh boy. Hi everybody, my name is Jennifer McCreeth and this is my fourth political campaign. And this is one that's seen me quietly under the radar. I never thought that that was going to happen. But apparently I am not newsworthy. Do people not remember who I am? It was huge news six years ago when I ran in the federal election. And it wasn't for the NDP, it was for a very small little party that nobody had ever heard of, but it was a national news story. I suppose that's good. Does that mean I'm just assimilating into society? Am I accepted into society, Newfoundland and Labrador? Even though I'm a mainlander, do you like me now? That's kind of my goal. Uh, when I ran for the NDP, one of my big goals was to prove that I could get along with anybody, a team. Jennifer's a loose cannon. I need to prove that I can be a team player. I can sit on the bench instead of go on the field. I can follow the leader. I can be nice to people. Well, we're now, well, this election was supposed to be over by now. It's still going on, but. Yeah, Jennifer McCreeth. Yeah, just want us to name on the ballot. I like to think I'm a little more than that. The NDP has six candidates on Wikipedia. Yeah, I'm one of the six. I'm supposedly one of your start candidates. But no, shh, Jennifer, stay quiet, sit on the bench. Let Allison do all the talking. And Sheila, Sheila, we got to get Sheila elected. Oh, Jim Din, he'll get, we'll get elected. Jordan Brown will get elected, but yeah. You just be quiet, shh, don't do anything, don't say anything, just retweet everything Allison puts out and retweet everything the NLNDP put out and everything will be just fine and you'll get your 9% of the vote and you can leave and say you were part of the NDP and live happily ever after, right? No! <laughs> I want more than just that. I get it. The NDP were hesitant to work with me because of who I am, who of what I've said. I used to crap on the NDP, but I like the NDP now. See that sign right there? I am damn proud of that. Jennifer McCreeth, candidate NDP. That means something, folks. That matters. I've been touting the party line because I like the party line. I like everything Alison Coffin is doing and saying. I get that she's the leader and she's going to get all the media. Maybe little old me running in Mount Pearl is not newsworthy. Come on, folks. There's 33 candidates. I know we didn't get 40, but we got 33 really good ones. The NDP is not the old left NDP from the Ed Broadbent days. This is Alison Coffin's NDP. She's an economist. Yes, we're on the left, but we're center left. We're not far left. The far lefts hate us. They either left the party or they tried to get me off the ballot. That's okay. Hi, Sean Burton. I know there's a Communist Party of Canada out there. Go ahead, create a Newfoundland Communist Party. Go right ahead. But that's not what you're getting, folks. We've got an incredible team of people with this NDP election. Go to the website. If you don't have the website, well, I don't know how you're on the web. Find out who your candidate is. Get one of their pamphlets. 
and learn about them. They've got an, we've got a bit of everything here in this party. Old, young, private sector experience, public sector experience, people who are lawyers, people who run small businesses, Labrador. We've got three young, vibrant, fired up. Dasher's even excited. Patricia Johnson Castle, Amy Norman, Jordan Brown. These are the star candidates in my opinion. Labrador, you put these three people into the uh, House of Assembly and I guarantee you things are going to get better. Not just for Labrador, but for all of Newfoundland and Labrador. Because these are some of the most amazing people I've ever seen in politics. I mean that. I wouldn't say that. And some of the other candidates that are just name on the ballots, they're more than that. They're working their butts off. Look at Peter Young. Look at his Facebook. He's got an amazing lengthy message full of great ideas every day. So come on, folks. Don't rule us out. I know you're angry at Andrew Fury. But Jess Crosby is not a solution. Vote NDP. Give us that opportunity. Give us a chance to lead government, even if it's the minority government. Give us that pencil. Or in this case, here, give us the Sharpie. Let us lead this thing. We'll work with the opposition. We'll get along with everybody. NDPs are good people. We're not angry. We're not miserable. We're not dragging each other in the mud like the Liberals and the Conservatives are. Even the pessimists are saying, well, the NDP is only going to win seven seats, eight seats. That might be enough to influence whether we get a majority or a majority. Or a minority. <laughs> if you love Chess Crosby, vote for him. If you love Andrew Fury, vote for him. If you're afraid of a minority, or if you're afraid of a majority government, send enough NDP members into that house. Nobody else can do that. The Alliance, I see you. Hi, Graydon, Andrea, a lot of good people. They only got six. We got 33. Even if you guys win a couple seats, even if you win all six, we need diversity. We can't give Andrew Fury a majority to just do whatever the hell he wants because I don't think he's proven that he knows what the hell he's doing. Should I be saying hell in these videos? That's not really, is that a swear word? I don't know. Dasher, yeah, what do you think? What do you think, Eddie? Do you have any idea on that? Comments? Quotes? No. Dasher's like, why do you keep putting these videos up on YouTube? Nobody's watching them. Well, hopefully a few people will watch this one. <laughs> Get on the, the registration list Friday, 8 p.m. If you want to vote in this election, you must apply for a mail-in ballot. And if you, if you can't if you're having trouble negotiating that website, people, phone me. Even if you're not in my writing. All you need is an email. Phone me, 753-9529. And if you can email me a picture of your ID, I will help you sign up. I want everyone voting in this election. Even if you're going to vote against me, I will help you get registered. How's that? Thank you to all the Commissioner of Oaths on uh, Twitter offering their services. I'm not a commissioner of oath, unfortunately, so I can't help you with that. Heck, I just helped someone signed up because they want to vote for Chess Crosby. Well, great. At least you're not voting for Ender Fury. Hello there, my name is Chess Crosby. Jennifer, oh, thank you very much for uh, helping uh, your friend uh, who's going to vote for me. Now, Mr. Chess, there's still three weeks. Is it three weeks? When's April 6th? I'm going to convince her not to vote for you, Chess. I got her on the ballot because she likes you, but I'm going to convince her to vote for... Thomas J. 
But yeah, get on the ballot. Everybody, please, don't sit this one out. Because if your voice is not heard, then you're letting others make those decisions for you. And you can't trust those others. Ten minutes, that's a long video. Are my videos too short or too long? Why aren't you people watching them? Usually I get a lot more clicks when I uh, do politics. Oh boy. Well, this one, I don't even know what to call the title of this one, but uh, maybe I'll just call it Vote. Thanks for watching.